Cancer is a scary disease for anybody, but especially for kids. This month is Childhood Cancer Awareness Month. Tonight, parents are sharing their stories with our John Piersos. Childhood cancer is not rare. It's a disease that impacts kids around the world. East Tennessee is no different. My daughter is Tillery. She was diagnosed when she was 15 months old. Elena Phillips says her now 10 year old daughter has been battling a rare brain tumor for most of her life. This year marks nine years that she's been battling a cancerous brain tumor. She is still on treatment. She's treated at St. Jude and um, she will always be a cancer patient. Phillips says her daughter's tumor can never fully be cured and that it is an ongoing fight. She says her family has had to make a lot of sacrifices. There's so much work that the parents have to do advocating for getting insurance to approve things, getting doctors to refer you where you need to be. Tillery's situation is unfortunately one of many. Data by CureSearch shows that 42 kids a day are diagnosed with cancer. East Tennessee Children's Hospital sees about 50 new cancer patients a year, but there is hope. And I've seen lots of advances in treatment. Amanda Martin, a nurse practitioner at East Tennessee Children's Hospital, says she's worked there for 30 years. And I've seen diseases that used to be uncurable are, are now cured. Martin says finding a cure and advancing treatment options is an ongoing fight. There are still diseases where kids will relapse and, um, and they need uh, treatment and we don't have a lot of options for some of the cancers. In Knoxville, John Piersos, WVLT News. Phillips says she's raising money and awareness all month long to try and help the cause.